Morning guys! So it is the last day in our hotel. I'm actually wearing uh, my new shirt from Wego. Way cute. But yeah man, we're about to head off to Osaka, I think. Yeah, Osaka first. Uh, I'm gonna go downstairs and have some of the buffet breakfast. Craig is down there already. So yeah, I'll check back in soon. Goodbye hotel room. Goodbye hotel room! We, we love loved you. you! Thank you! Thank you! Oh, this is it! I got these noodles, they're like supposedly quite spicy actually. I'm not good with spice, so yeah, that was a good choice by me. But maybe I won't mix in this because that's what looks spicy. And I got melon soda. Look at this. Look at this. This is his burger. What did you get? Uh, spicy chicken burger. Spicy chicken burger. With and long fries. fries. Honestly, in some ways, this place is reminding me of Argentina. Like, I think it's just all the wires and the tall, narrow buildings and stuff. Our key to our Airbnb. Which room is it? This one here. So this is our room, 701. Let's go inside, guys. I have my slippers on, yay! So this is the bed area. Now this was called like the suite room, so everything's like pink theme. So this is the bed that looks like our pocket Wi-Fi. We have little like futon couch. Here's a mirror, which is perfect. I can show you outfit of the days. <laughs> Somewhere to put our clothes. This is the little kitchen area. Oh my gosh, so we fridge, a we burner, the bin is pink. Oh yes, I saw these on the website. So they're like the super cute cups. <laughs> I was hoping they would still be here. This must be the bathroom. Let's see how this opens. Oh, oh, push. Cool bananas. Oh my gosh, it's really high up. <laughs> so this is the loo, the bath area. It is small, but mate, it is what it is, eh? Here we have a little station with all the goodies. Oh, even vacuum cleaner, help keep the place clean. We have a pink jug because, mate, she's the sweet room, eh? And this is it. Craig's already opened the balcony. Let's have a wee look. We're living like locals. <laughs> We're right by the, like, a freeway. Could you call that a freeway? And then, yeah, can you see the canal down there, like the water? So we've had our rest at the hotel. We are all rugged up again and good to go outside. It's actually really cold early spring. Um, and now we're like further south in Japan, I suppose. And so I feel like it's colder. Uh, or maybe it's not because it's closer to the equator. Anyways, we're ready to go. We're gonna go explore around the like neighborhood that we're staying in. It's a pretty good shopping district kind of thing. So yeah, we're gonna have a wee peek at what there is and then yeah, we'll probably get some munchies while we're out. Uh, I'm loving the Sakura room, or is it called the sweet room? It totally sweet is, room. it's the sweet room, but um, super cute. Can you see I'm hanging out with my lovely plant and we have the lovely curtain in the background. I should probably close that one a little bit more, shouldn't I? But yeah, man, so I'll bring you along if you wanna see. do it here is our 200 yen he is our girl let's go
Oh my gosh, can you see it? Maybe I'm too close to the camera. Yeah, that good. Super gooey. Let's try, let's try. Mm. It tastes like jelly. And then red bean paste in the middle, which is fabulous. Mm. <laughs> Sakura cook. Oh my gosh, yum yum. I think it's actually just Coca-Cola. It even says original taste. Um, what do you think, Craig? <laughs> it's a really cute bottle, mind you. It's definitely just original Coke, yeah. Coke, but you know but what? beautiful. She's beautiful. <laughs> mm. So we just got these. And I just thought it was cheese on a stick, man. But it's like a sugary cinnamon donut with cheese in the middle and fries on the outside. Oh my god. I think you're gonna have to be. We're gonna have to go. Outfit of the day. She is blue and pink, and I'm wearing my new jumper that I got last night from WeGo. I love it, it's so super cute. <laughs> we are gonna head off to go get something yummy to eat, and then we are gonna go check out Osaka Castle. So that should be fabulous. I found a place that does the hot drink out of a vending machine, which is way exciting. And it's in a can. Oh my god, it's totally toasty. Wow. It's way hot. Oh my god, it's really sweet. Is it? Yum! Oh, this is like the best cup of coffee I've had here. Fire out, man. Out of a can. This is my favorite drink. I'm gonna get one. This is amazing. Craig's gonna buy one because it's like legit delicious. We're gonna have some ramen for breakfast. Two, well, I, think we I think push the money first. <laughs> so this is like the vending machine. If you could see, Craig. Oh, oh, I'm really zoomed in. There it is. Craig is going to use it. Here is the menu. Picture menus are the way forward, man. So we are going to choose number two, and we're just going to share it because we're not super hungry. Oh, oh, he's doing it. He's doing it. Boop. Wow, looks cute. Looks cute. Okay, let's go inside. I absolutely adore this about Japan, and I think a lot of Asian countries actually. So there's cold water where there's hot, and I'm totally a hot water drinking person. And everyone always gives me crud in New Zealand or whatever. And so here's my cup. Do you see? She's steamy. And here's Craig because Craig likes the cold water. <laughs> so can you see the kitchen actually? Do you see the um, baskets for noodles? Yum yum yum! I'm so excited. <laughs> Here's our breakfast, guys. We've got ramen to share because honestly, we have not been really hungry in Japan. So things don't tend to open up until like 10 or 10.30. As you can see, all of these shops are closed. We did check them out last night, but I missed the, the Sanrio like shop. It was, it was closed by the time we got to it. So that's definitely gonna be something that we're gonna hit up tonight. I forgot my Suyaka card and my jacket, so we're gonna check out what it's like to buy a ticket. Okay, we got it, so that was actually like super easy. Yay, Craig! At least we get this experience one time. <laughs> I'll remember my Suyaka card, all the rest. Here we go, guys, let's do it. So they totally have these like collectible, I suppose, uh, Coca-Cola bottles. We already have one with the Sakura and now we're going to get the Osaka Castle design. <gasps> oh, this is like, I don't know, perfect for my hoarding dreams. <laughs> they sucker us in every time. Every time. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Boop -boop -boop. I love vending machines. I'm gonna start a campaign to make New Zealand open fabulous vending machines. <laughs> let's see, let's see, hold it up. Cute! Craig is superstar photographer. Wow, look at him go! This is the line, so we need to hop in it.
eating some kumara fries under some nice trees and having a bit of a rest honestly all those stairs were full on So it is our second to last day here in Osaka. I'm super excited because today we are going to go check out Nara Deer Park, which will be lovely. We're going to feed the deers, check out the shrines. But uh, first we're going to go head out and get some brekkie. We're probably going to hit up that same ramen shop as yesterday. There's not much open at this time in the morning, but um, if not, that ramen place was fabulous, to be honest. I would, I would happily go back there. Uh, I'll show you what I'm wearing really quickly. So this is the outfit today. Finally, it's feeling warm enough that like I'm not wearing a jumper. I put some sunscreen on my arms for the first time in like a week and it was really nice. Um, I'm wearing tights if you're wondering because you know, story of my life. But yeah, let's go! We have found another collectible Coca-Cola bottle, the Nara one. Ooh. <laughs> we are gonna have a million of these. Cute with the deer. <laughs> oh, we got this one. She has Daisy oh. on her arm. She's really cute. Oh, she's the main big one actually. Craig is saying goodbye to his favorite deer. He calls him the old man deer.
got back home from Nara Park. It was such a lovely morning out. It was a really good idea going like straight thing in the morning kind of thing. Um, it got really busy around about midday when we were leaving. The crowd started getting like intense and you could barely get like any photos or anything without, I don't know, hundreds of people in the background. And the deer were getting really sleepy. Like I guess midday is when it was really hot as well. So at that point, um, they were all kind of like chilling out under trees. Whereas when we were there, they were like walking around in a bit more sprightly so it was totally a good choice. Uh, on the way home we went past uh, America Mura I think and um, it's like American village or whatever and it's really funky and we found lots of things that we love. I found an Angelic Pretty. I didn't realize there was one here so that was my first time inside Angelic Pretty. It was beautiful. It was stunning. I could have cried. I was like so happy about it and the girls who were in there were like really cute. Craig said they could see uh, Craig said that he could see them smiling at me because I was just like ah dying while running around and looking at everything I couldn't afford anything clearly um, <laughs> but you know what I am gonna save a lot of my Lolita shopping for closet child so they do secondhand stuff and yeah maybe a bit more affordable for me but um it was so nice to go into like the official store and see it in person it was just it was beautiful my lord that was like one of those dream dream ticks off the list i think <laughs> so yeah we're just having a little bit of a refresh here at home we're gonna grab some extra money because we had to top up our suyaka card so we ran out of money <laughs> so yeah man refresh and then we're gonna head back to america muda because we have a couple of things we want to buy and then yeah maybe another chill and probably some food or something but it's been a really lovely day so far <laughs> So it's actually the next morning now. Uh, the last thing that you may have seen would have been Craig and I going out for dinner. So last night we went to this like traditional Japanese barbecue where you get to like fry your own meat and stuff right in front of you. So it's like on coals. It was so hot and smoky but like so delicious. We got this like steak which was like the most expensive thing on the menu and it's like this wagyu. Is that how you say it? Yeah, yeah, Wagyu, wagyu yeah. steak, right? It was 20 bucks and like really small, but oh my lord, it's the best steak that I've ever eaten in my life. Like I swear to gosh, it was so soft and delicious. I don't know. I'm not much of a big meat eater and as you know, I've been vegan for a really long time, so... I don't know, it was quite quite the experience. I was well into it though. But um, anyways, that was yesterday. And so <laughs> I guess I'm just wrapping this up and uh, today's gonna be a new day. So I'm gonna start today's vlog from now. So thanks for watching guys. And uh, hopefully you're enjoying these Japan journeys as much as me. Bye.